DMB here and today it is the release day of Pokemon Celebrations. Honestly, I have been so hyped for this. Uh, so I found this box in game. I think it's a game exclusive box. Uh, it was I think £52 or I think that's I think it's $52.50 I think in the USA not sure but I'm pretty sure uh, I think in the USA you can get this on Amazon so if you guys want to cop this I think you can get it on Amazon but if you're in the UK you can get this again I have absolutely no idea what is in this box but uh, off camera uh, with some of my mates I opened some celebrations earlier and luckily I came prepared with some Blastoise sleeves I got this from a Blastoise VMAX box I opened a while ago I, I will be honest with you guys I have been opening a lot of Pokemon cards off the channel but if you guys like leave a load of likes and you want to see more Pokemon then uh, <laughs> you then I know you guys want to see Pokemon but first I'm going to show you some stuff so we have this uh cool uh pin which is a uh, surfing pikachu then if you like switch it around turns into flying pikachu it's a bit like wobbly at the bottom but you know but that's cool uh, i got a lance's charizard box and a zashin or zashin don't know how to pronounce it uh pin collection and uh let's just say i got treated well with my paws so, I'm going to show you the best card I got first. Oh, uh, it's just the one top part. So, I packed a Gold Star Umbreon, guys. I'm really happy about this. Uh, Gold Star Umbreon. I think it's the uh, second rarest card in the set. Second or third. Because there's the Charizard, the Gold Mew. But this, I think, I looked on eBay. I know eBay isn't the most, like, <laughs> uh, best site to look on if you're looking for prices. But it went around 80 to 120 Uh UK pounds, and then you have Lancer's Charizard. Try to speed this up so we can get into the box. So I know that's what you guys want to see. We have Fly Pikachu V Max. This is an awesome card. We have uh, so the promo that came with Zashin box, Zashin Level X. Then we have Xerneas EX, Zashin or Zashin V. This was one of my chase cards. I'm so happy I pulled this. I went absolutely mad when I pulled this. Uh, if you guys can hear something in the background, it's just our dog. Uh, she decided to sit, sit on her bed, and I think that was a yawn you guys just heard. So if you do hear any barking, apologies, that is just our dog. Uh, yeah, but I'm really happy that I packed this. Uh, you will see a duplicate because I did get two. Uh, and then the professor's research card. This is awesome. Uh, what I really like this about this card is the arm come out. I love that. I'm going to speed up a bit, guys. Uh, so there's Clever. Awesome. Dark Gyarados. I think this is a fairly rare card in the Celebration set. I love this card. And uh, I just want to make my... So so I just want to make my comment here. People saying that the uh, 25th anniversary stamp is a bit too big. In person... It looks absolutely fine, in my opinion, but I'm not sure if there's, I think there might be comments disabled on this video, because you know what YouTube are like with that. And then, uh, like, I didn't get much out of, because, you know, it's not just celebrations that comes with some celebrations products. So I got a Rapid Strike, Urshu VMAX, and a Battle Stars. I was actually really shocked when I pulled this, because I, this like, probably like my third ever Battle Stars pack, so I was quite happy with that. And then I did pull a second Pikachu and a second Surfing Pikachu. Uh, sorry if you guys can't quite see the cards. I do have them in Blastoise sleeves for the Blastoise VMAX box, which I got a while ago. Which I got a while ago. Anyway, it's time to open this thing. I have absolutely no idea what to expect. So, uh, hoping you guys can see it. We do have DMB Day behind the camera to guide me. But we're going to open this now. I'm going to like turn it around so I can actually see what's in there. Right, this is the big reveal. There are some... I need to lift them up a little bit to undo the flaps. We did get the tape off and you guys are ready. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, I'm going to turn this around for you guys. 
Oh my. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Guys, do you see that? Do you see that? Okay, so there is the Dragapult. Uh, Dragapult Prime. Uh, like, little leaflet thing. If you guys want to read that, you can pause the video. We have... Oh my god, I was actually going to ask one of these! I was going to ask one of these for Christmas, done after, you know? It's a jumper card binder, guys. I'm very happy. Yes! Yes! It's the Dragapult binder! This is going to be my celebrations binder. This is the Dragapult binder which you get out of the Dragapult uh, thing. Uh, pin collection type thing. What is this? Oh, oh that's, that's sick. The Mimikyu Jumbo card, guys. We can, I'm going to put that in my binder later. Um, there is. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a lot. <laughs> so I think this is the Dragapult uh, Jumbo card that comes. I don't think so. This is Dragport Prime. I know that. So it comes with Dragport Prime. This does not come with the Dragport Prime box. I know this doesn't for a fact because I brought one uh, for my friend today. He's very appreciative of it. So I know what comes with some celebrations product. And, oh, oh, this is interesting. A light Toxtricity. I don't think there's been light Pokemon since like Neo Genesis. I want to see or Neo Destiny. I know my Pokemon set, <laughs> so yeah. I want to say Neo, Neo, one of the Neos, and then there's. I'm not even gonna attempt to pronounce that. <laughs> uh, I have no idea how to pronounce that, but that's cool. And then I'm gonna. Is there anything else on the cardboard? No, nope, there's nothing under the cardboard, ladies and gentlemen. There is one thing in here, which I, there is the collector's chest, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's like a little lunchbox. Quite sure you get, I think you do get some celebrations booster packs in here, but this is awesome. I'm gonna put that to the side, we can open that later. We do have, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh. So we guys, we do have a Dragapult Prime. Uh, I am going to quickly sleeve that, guys. So I do not want that card getting damaged. That's if I don't drop the sleeve, I will pick that up after the recording. <laughs> right. Sorry, guys, if I'm like on it. I have not filmed a video in a while. Uh. I'm like not quite used to the YouTube thing yet, but we have some booster packs here. So we have one, two, three. We have three celebrations booster packs. I just want to quickly get the coin. Uh, I'm just it's quite hard to get out. So we have the coin, awesome, uh, DMB Dave will now hopefully take away the box <laughs> so you guys can actually see me open all this stuff. And we do have a Chilling Rain Booster Pack and a Vivid Voltage Boost Pack. Uh, I'm actually really excited for this Vivid Voltage Boost Pack, one of my favourite sets. So we will put the Boost Packs over here. Uh, DMB Dave, do you think we should open the collector's chest first? What do you want me to open first? Let me give. So the booster packs or the collector's chest? Booster packs. Right, so we're going to open the single booster packs first. So uh, we are going to leave the celebrations booster packs last. And we will open this chilling rain booster pack. If I can get it open. Uh, I will look at the code card so I know what, ideally, hopefully what we're going to get. Actually, you know what? I won't. Unless, oh, well, it's it it it's green, ladies and gentlemen. It's a green code. But we do have 
energy, we have Raboot, we have that person, Rapid Scroll thing, we have Seal, no what that is, uh, Hatina, Rockruff, have Shop It, we have a uh, Snowy Castle, we have a Bomb Snow, and we have Anthros. Right, well, that was our chilling rain pack. <laughs> Uh, or chilling pain, as me and my mates call it. As let's be honest, chilling rain is not a set that I recommend selecting. It's not a very good set, in my opinion. It, uh, it has some good cards in it. I'm not saying it's a like bad set. I just say the pull rates are terrible. And we have a green code from Vivid. I did actually open some Vivid today. I did get a. Uh, Bay or B, I don't know how to say it, uh, that fighting trainer from Sword and Shield. Uh, and then I got an amazing rare Raikou. So we do have Metal Energy, Stone Energy, we have Shuckle, we have Cramorant. And I'm just going to say, uh, we can pull amazing rares from White Coat, uh, not White Coat cards, Green Coat cards, because I did it today. Mukuri, Weeper, Ninkada, Wisma, Drawba. Beauty and that thing. Uh, I, like, if I don't know how to pronounce it, I just won't say it <laughs> because, like, it's not really even worth trying. I'm just gonna mix these up. Hope we get something good. I'm gonna open this boost pack first. I uh, like celebrations is one of my new favorite sets. It probably is now my favorite set. It's just amazing. Chilling, uh, not chilling rain, uh, celebrations. I'm loving it. Uh, so we have Cosmoc, we have Growl, we have Luvia, we have Professor's Research. All right, well, I think that's my third Professor's Research. Guys, remember, every uh, celebrations card has a stamp on it, and they're all hollow cards. So, I mean, I hope I showed this, but that's cool. And now we are opening the second boost pack. These are fairly easy to open, but also, like, once you get to the bottom of the pack, they're quite hard to open. I'll try not to damage the cards as I try to take the boost pack out. Uh, so we have Yveltal, Lugia, Clefa. I have already pulled this, but we have Solgaleo. Uh, I, use, I still sleeve up that Clefa. I will put that in my sleeve pile. And then we do have a celebrations, uh, last celebrations boost pack before we move on it onto the collector's chest. So hopefully we have something decent out of this celebrations booster pack if I can get the wrapping off. Please celebrations booster pack, let me see what is inside of you. We do have a Garden, a Kyoga, a Rusharam. And a Zashian V, I think I may have already pulled this. I'm not quite sure, so I'm going to put it in a sleep pile. And uh, now we do indeed have a collector's chest. Or the lunchbox, as people like to call it. No idea what this has in it, but we're just going to dive straight into it. All right. Oh, 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 okay. Okay. So it has uh, another coin. And then three of the mini cards, of the jumbo cards that we got. That's nice. You have... You have a... Uh, do you have a couple celebrations? Oh, that was annoying. Uh, so, just getting... Thank you, DME Dave, for my error. That was annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six. We are six. Celebrations booster packs and a vivid voltage booster pack, a battle styles boost and a battle styles booster pack. We also do have in this collector's chest put the booster packs there. Uh, this is actually really hard to get. So we do have some stickers. Look there. Like a load of stickers. Mm. 
Wow, they really like their stickers, don't they? There are just sheets and sheets of these. Oh my. See how thick that is? And there's like a little, like, I think that's a war book. You guys can see that. This is like. Alright, well, here we go. <laughs> oh, it's a notepad. Oh, a little uh, notepad. That's nice. We do indeed have. I think it's a small binder. This is a tiny binder. No way. Oh my god. It's a tiny little binder. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, it's a tiny little binder. Then we do have like. Sorry, this opening is quite hectic. We do have uh, some stuff to up. Uh, we do have that. So you guys can pause if you want to read that. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> this is an absolute mess. There's so much. So I move the collector's chest to there. And then we have our mini celebrations binder. Now we will mix up our celebrations boost packs, just like that. We will start off with battle styles. I can open them. Oh. I don't think that's supposed to happen, but all right. It's like they steal this like so well. Let me try it from the bottom. Like, just like, the straight up, just like, plastic on the pack is coming off. It is a green code card, uh, so I'm just gonna, like, speed through this. So it was a primer, eep, and a power shoe. Now, this is Vivid Voltage, one of my favourite sets. And this is another green code. Oh, there's so many green codes to do. Oh, the celebrations make up for it. There's a green code, just gonna skip through it. So we have AC, Light, and a Lycan Rock. Um, I thought I'd run unlucky. Well, celebrations it is then. Let's hope celebrations can save. Can save us. Sorry guys, you've no idea how hard these these packs are to open. Right, so we have a Kyogre, Xerneas, here comes Team Rocket, and a Surfing Peaks UV. This is the third one I've bought today. This card is so, like, ridiculously common. I'm gonna sleeve it still. But here comes Team Rocket, beautiful card. I think this was in I have the Team Rocket set, I think I remember it being in XY Evolutions. Never opened that set, but I watched some videos on it. I, it's a good set, XY Evolutions. I think it was in XY Evolutions. You guys can correct me if comments aren't disabled on this video. Right. So, I tried to do a card trick then, what am I doing? Diago. Palkia. Play doll. Oh, that's nice. And then <laughs> if you guys have not just skipped through the video, this is my third one I pulled. This card apparently is really common, but it's sick, so I honestly do not care. <laughs> I'm getting some decent pull, but like it's just repeats. My god, I like bended. Like, that was not good. No, I don't think. Like, this is like weird. I swear. I don't think I, I pulled a hoe today. Probably that will change. So we have a Lugia, a Cosmon, Gravon, and a Zamazen TV. I don't think I have Zamazen TV. <laughs> so I'm definitely gonna. Sorry about the mess, guys. Um. I'm gonna clean this up. <laughs> Alright, so we do have two booster packs remaining after this. 
So we're halfway through, through I don't know. So we do have your Veltal. Die out. Zekrom and Professor's Research again. <laughs> this is starting like because of these four card set, like it's gonna get like so repetitive because the set is so small. But like the thing is like there's so many cards to get, but like I'm just not getting them. <laughs> right. So second to last pack, we do have Dialga or Dialga, Zekrom, Reshiram, and Solgaleo. Okay. <laughs> Well, this is seeming to be a uh, bit of a disappointment, but hopefully the last pack can save us. And I've practically looked at pack and pack. All right. Packs are just like, because the cards are so, like, I, it doesn't make sense. Like, the cards are, like, so thin that you just cannot get them out. So, of course, Moon. Dialga. Oh, oh, oh my god! Shiny Magikarp! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is one of the, This is so rare! And then we have... Luna. Oh my god, I'm getting that. I'm just leaving immediately. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm just leaving that immediately. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, well the last pack really did just save the opening. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. Shining Magikarp. This is... I don't know what to say. Uh, so... My thoughts on this box... Uh, if you're in it for the packs, I think there's a decent amount of boost packs in here. But I'd rather buy, I think, an ETB, because you just get... But if you're, like, a collector, a bit like me, uh, and you want items like the collector's chest and everything, uh, that, this is a good box to buy if you, like, are a collector and you want stuff like this. So, yeah, guys, thanks for watching, uh, I really hope you enjoyed this Pokemon video. If you want to see more Pokemon videos, smash a like on this video, uh, press the notification bell, subscribe, and, uh, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace!